Well, it is National Puppy Day, so I asked our friends at Aggieland Humane Society to bring some adorable, adoptable pups. Savannah Gaines is here with us. God bless you for bringing these little treats to us today. <laughs> yes. These are just some of the pups. Tell us who they are. Yes, this is Tweet and this is Chirp, and they are, we believe, Great Pyrenees Shepherd Mixes. They are just the sweetest the sweetest guys uh, two, two brothers their other siblings have been adopted so they're they're hoping to get adopted today I don't think Justin did you give him a treat and not him yes, oh. yes I did. <laughs> you gotta be fair you can't I'm do sorry. that look, come here, look. yeah that's the yeah they're very sweet so you all I, we know it's a busy springtime uh, you all have lots of great animals how what can people do um, and you know to find their forever friend at the shelter yeah so come on out you know and we can help you just ask uh, tell us what your lifestyle is and um, what kind of uh, size and everything you're looking for and we can match you with you know the perfect dog for you and then just keep always watching the website too so we, we will make it really easy and of course they're all ready to go so spayed neutered microchip vaccinated and everything Justin, do you follow them on social media? I don't, but I you do should. now. Yes. I saw yes. the picture this morning that you just posted, so I just hit it. Yay. <laughs> and that is a great way to stay up to date on some of the stuff that's happening. Uh, we're, of course, we're talking about National Puppy Day today. But there's lots of fantastic animals. Somebody might want an older dog, right. or you might want a kitten or a cat. There's something for everyone. Yeah, and kitten season is, we have tons of kittens in foster care and, and more coming in every day. So we'll have lots of kittens soon, and we're getting in puppies every day, just like these guys. And we discovered this one has a little double dew claw, so it's extra special. Which I have <laughs> never seen that in person. Yeah, it's That's pretty cool. Fantastic. Okay, I know there's some people in our community who are like, I just, I can't commit to adopting a pet right now. But there are other ways they can help. You have volunteers who come out and watch, walk the dogs, you foster, you do things like that, other ways to help. Tell us how we can do that. Yeah, so uh, definitely if you can't adopt, foster, donate, volunteer. Um, so if you wanna do any of those things, you go to our website, aggielandhumane.org. There are steps to take and, and fostering, especially right now with puppy and kitten season is so critical. And then volunteering, of course, to make sure those dogs get and cats get socialization. So it's all so important and a great way to, to show love for the pets because they show us so much love they sure do yeah. and we talked about um they, sometimes they do field trips justin would do uh, do you agree with me can we make our plea for our, our bosses right now that they let the puppies come and make field trips here so please. we get that therapy please at least once a week i'm <laughs> always complaining i'm saying you never bring dogs in mom <laughs> <laughs> well now we did savannah thank you for getting up early and bringing the pups to us y'all aggielandhumane.org and again if you don't already follow them on social media Cheers and happy puppy day to y'all. We'll be right back uh, with today's top stories and your birthdays and anniversaries and applause. <laughs>